Hello and welcome back. This is Bishtaw, and today we are playing Battlefleet Gothic Armada. We have our poor forefront ship here that has done a lot of hip heavy lifting for us. It has done 16 battles in total. That is more than all of our ships. So it's been with us for quite a while and it's played an integral part of this entire campaign so far. And it will be unfortunate that we won't be able to take it into the next fight with us because I'm not going to do a priority repair on it. We have plenty of other ships and it's not quite necessary for us to do it. Now I don't necessarily think you can lose the skirmish at this point because well I'm actually not quite sure if we can lose it or not but I don't think we will. This is only on medium so we will leave it at that. We are doing another space station assault, however. We are again the attacker. And we are fighting the Imperium this time. Now, we're still taking in the same amount of ships, but we're dealing with one less cruiser and taking in one more light cruiser. We also don't have one escort ship. However, I don't think that's going to make much of a difference because we didn't quite need it last time. So let's go right in and do this fight. All right, here is our wonderful space station that we have to destroy kind of interested to see what the orc space station would look like because this is very beautiful look at that if I can get a photo but there we go look at those guns and compared size oh wow we can zoom right in very beautiful game. Alright, so from last time we know that all we have to do is destroy that target and we win the game. So let's do just that. I feel like this mission could be Harder, but at the same time, I'm not quite sure how they would make it harder, especially in a balance situation, because this is what orcs are best at, is ramming. Alright, you missed horribly there. Good work. All right, let's we go. drop some torpedoes at him. You want us over there? We're not going to use your torpedoes because I'm you probably going to hit one of these ships. Oh, oh, oh. All right, a Mars battle cruiser. Very nice has a no cannon and it fired hit all of us because we are bunched up which probably isn't the best idea but we're going to be doing a lot of damage all right we're going to have you be the first to ram we'll have you Ram that target. And we'll have you do another Nova Cannon. Oh, 
Foxy's best. Oh goodness. Alright. Very beautiful. Are ramming. That actually did nothing. That's pretty fish. Alright, we're gonna throw a torpedo at him. Probably needed more speed on it. I'll be completely honest there. Um, Mars is keeping pretty far away. All right, now we did quite a bit of damage there. All right. Let's actually repair and do retros, because he's taking quite a bit of damage. Oh goodness, what is happening right there? Oh, I guess we are dueling. Oh, we did get, we did take heavy damage, which is very unfortunate for us. Although we did destroy the station with the brute force ability of ramming until it dies. All right, let's, we took two heavily damaged. Well then, I've really got to keep count of my ships better. Because if we continue up that, we're going to have a loss of ships. All right, I did know about this. This was go definitely gonna happen. I'm not quite sure what that gas is. If it was decompressing, then it would stop and be decompressed. But it seems like it's just shooting off an infinite amount of metal into the into space. Oh goodness. I also lost you. Uh you were just these you, you were important, I'm not going to say you weren't, but in the long list of ships that I'd rather not die, you're kind of at the bottom. Alright, our battle cruiser. Let's give him one more master gunner. And then let's give him an upgrade. I'm thinking we could give him heavy gunners or no, not shield break. Or really big guns. Meaning that this front gun, instead of having a 3,000 range, it would have a 6,000 range. more teleport does. I, I don't find lightning strike to be that particularly useful because it only does one strike whereas boarding does multiple. 
I suppose if you were going to have the ability of oh we are lagging there but as I was saying if you're going to have the ability to have one more lightning strike kind of makes it better, but at the same time, all you get is a little bit extra range and the ability to fire front and back of you. I feel like the only use for that would be a warp stopper, which I suppose would be decent with paired with big mech, but even then it's still not that great I feel. Anyways, um, let's get extra shields. Oh, that's 200. Do we want to spend 200 on a ship that we won't use for a turn? No, let, well, we can, no wait. No, you're a battle cruiser, what I'm talking about. Uh, yes, actually, I do want to spend 200 on a ship that I will use. All right get one more skill could get stasis bomb could get disruption bomb and have this ship just be our bomber the disruption bomb would be super useful against space stations too and I'm sure we'll never fight another space station again in this campaign because I just picked it but anyways, let's go on to our next battle. Alright, we are now the attacker on a convoy mission. And we have four line ships. That's not great. Although, we could just ram everything and everyone let's get two ram ships and then two of the savage gunships we haven't used the ram ship yet and I haven't either uh, it has only a hundred hull integrity it has one gun it has slightly more speed and it's slightly more maneuverable and it does, I believe, 300% more ramming damage. So it is the perfect ship to hit those transports. Alright. We are also fighting orc transports. Now, we, why is, I don't know why that was there. We're going to start in the middle, and um, we're going to have our one brute and one savage on both flanks. Not that far to the flank though, because, well there's an asteroid field there. We don't want to deal with that. Enemy oh wow. That is a lot. Alright. So where are your here's three. Now we need to destroy three of their transport ships, it looks like. Oh wait, do they only have three? They Go guide us! No oh, wait, they have six. Right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, they have six. So shouldn't we only have to destroy... Oh wait, no, we have... In the defense, we had to get four out. The fight is over here. So yes, that would make sense entirely. What doesn't make sense is me trying to attack two guys when we could attack four guys. 
will send you two to deal with it because you have a Nova Cannon. Alright, we'll start with that. <laughs> oh, there we go. It did take some damage. Not a lot. They do have an awful lot of ships, though. I suppose we have quite a few ships as well, but... You got it. Goodness gracious. Get him! Alright. He's ready! And we forgot about you two. Mm. That's never good. Alright, I'm going to try and... Can we go faster? Ram the ship. Oh, we just got tractored. Let's get out of there. Oh, just dodged that. Oh, oh wow, we nearly destroyed that ship. Maybe we can destroy it there? No, we can't. We didn't quite destroy it, although we came very close to destroying it. Got a Nova Cannon him. Alright, we've lined him up. And let's ram him. We might destroy him. No, we did not destroy him. Alright. Uh, can we get... Oh, we forgot the board. Oh wait, we got it. Alright. Alright, so we have to destroy him. And him. Can I have two ships? Yeah, he's right there. What are you doing? Alright, so we just have to destroy this ship and then we pretty much won. Ah, he's tracking us away. Imagine what this transport ship is thinking right now. Apparently, it's thinking that it can survive that. Nope, it can't. And we get a beautiful image of deep space. There we go. Nice explosion there. All right. Let's see what we've earned. Looks like next mission we will get to level six. Um, we leveled up one of our ships. We didn't take any heavy damage this time. So that means that all of our ships are back in action. No longer do we have to worry about running out of ships. This is wonderful. All right, let's give you grats. And you know what? I think we give you a favor. But which one? Plus one to boarding actions. You are quick. And you do 50% more ramming damage. You can get the tractor cannon the ship is moved in the direction desired by the player and combustion refills a little bit quicker you know what I kind of want to do the ramming one
because we've upgraded the engines on the ship and then I think we're gonna get the 25% increase on combustion right also and let's see what it looks like Ooh, very nice that kind of looks like a cannon almost But it looks much stronger. It's got a little protruding tooth there. Very orcish. Alright then. I have been Bishtaw. This has been Battlefleet Gothic Armada. And if you've enjoyed the video, please remember to like and comment down below. And if you're feeling really brave, why not subscribe? You know you want to. Come on, listen to more of this stuff. Anyways, hope you have a wonderful day.